today is a special day because last night we passed 250,000 subscribers. A quarter of a million people are interested enough in blacksmithing and what I do here in my dingy little workshop to hit that red subscribe button. Do you know how unbelievable this is? Now, when I started blacksmithing eight years ago, now, you know, as, as a young 11-year-old, I trawled through the internet, finding as much information as I could. And there were some fantastic resources, but the, the amount of content out there about blacksmithing, not so much. The amount of people interested in blacksmithing was certainly a lot fewer. Now, that 250,000 people want to see steel being forged, it blows my mind. I am so thrilled. I love, I love this craft so much, and I, and I love other people loving this craft because it's a lot of fun. And wow, a quarter of a million people are interested enough in seeing hot metal get squished and throwing sparks and fire that they want to hit subscribe. That is unbelievable. I'm so happy. Thank you for taking the time to subscribe to me. Thank you for all the time that you take watching my videos. Thank you so much. It means the world to me. Not only does it mean that the craft that I love gets shown to as many people as possible, but it means that I get to live a life that I, I truly could only dream of. Being able to make things every single day, being able to, being able to live my, my, my passion, my passion being making things and creating things. So thank you guys so much. My gratitude is, is it's, it's, my gratitude is this big. So thank you. <laughs> All of those hammers are the hammers that I finished forging yesterday. Now, this is now part six and a half. I imagine this is getting a little bit tedious. But still, I need to continue making 70 or so hammers. Here is, I don't know, maybe 35 or so. There's another 35 outside. We're gonna keep forging them. After all of that, that's it. That's it. This is the last one. That's actually not true. This isn't the last one. I have to make a few cross beans, so I'm gonna sit down, I'm gonna eat, and then I'm gonna light the forge again, and then I'm gonna take some of these and forge a cross pin on it. This is what my welding table looks like right now. That is a lot. And I mean a lot of hammers. <laughs> I've eaten lunch, it's nice, peace and quiet. All the equipment is quiet, apart from the forge, it is lit. Because right now, after having noted down what weights I need to make some of these into cross peen hammers, I'm now gonna go ahead and pick some out, and I'm gonna throw them in the forge, and we're gonna be making some cross peen hammers. Here are the two and a half pounders. Four and a half pounder. Three and a half pounders. Four three and a half pounders. Four three and a half pounders. You see, I forged these like my normal rounding hammers, which is a good thing, because it means that on the round side, I can forge the peen out and I have less fish mouthing developed. I'm gonna be drawing the taper on the Pilkington power hammer. You guys have seen this before. 100 weight power hammer, so it's got a ram that weighs about 120 pounds. And I'm gonna take all the tooling I have out, and we're gonna be using this. This is a bottom tapering die, so this will do half the taper. I have to hold my material at a lower angle, turn regularly, and then I'll have to clean up the trough lines and maybe reinsert the drift by then going back over to the Sehin... Sehinla!
finish forge cross pin. This is an enormous pile of finished forged square circle rounding hammers. This cross pin is going amongst the other cross pins. Holy moly! I have just made over 70 hammers. Well, I've just finished forging on it. I still have so much work to do. Next week, I'm gonna be grinding, heat treating, handling, and boxing these things all up. These were ordered back in March in my last hammer pre-order, and, and it was unbelievable. It was a great joy. I don't know when I'm gonna have av hammers available soon. So many of you have been asking me. I'm so sorry that they're not more readily available. I might have a few spare after this. Um, I believe I had 71 orders, and I made 76 or a little more, just as like a, you know, just as like a wasted contingency in case there were any that I I needed to kind of not pick, but they all look fantastic, so I might have a few spare. So be on the lookout. Thank you so much, those of you that are wanting the hammers. I apologize for, for it being so difficult to get one of these. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I want to answer one question because I want to fill up this video with some more goodness, and that is, Alec, when are you appearing on Forged in the Fire? I know so many of you are asking and recommending that I go on the show, and I thought I'd break it down for the final time because I've explained it a lot in the live shows, and I think that you guys that watch the vlogs also want to know I'm not going to be going on Forged in Fire. I got very close to deciding to go on it. I even, they sent the contracts over to me. We were all ready to do it. And in fact, we probably would have just finished the filming had I been on the show. But I slept on it a little bit. I thought about whether this is what I wanted to do. And I remembered that really, I want to be making YouTube videos. I want to be here, hanging out with you guys on YouTube. Part of me, this is where I want to take my business. This is, the, the, this is where I, what I really enjoy. Plus, I'm a novice knife maker, plus it's, it's just a massive time investment. I'd rather hang out with you guys. So that was the decision I made. Rather than spending two to three weeks of time doing all of that shooting to do the show, I'm here hanging out with you guys and I'm really pleased that you're all enjoying the episodes. It's been a lot of fun and it means that I get to learn knife making at a pace that I'm more comfortable with and focus on making you guys. Make this the top priority. Make you guys in these videos the top priority because I want, I want to put everything into the YouTube channel and I really am so grateful that you've been watching. If you got this far, which you have, obviously, because you're watching. I don't know. I'm sweating. I'm po like pouring with sweat. It's difficult for me to, difficult for me to know what I'm trying to say. But since you're here, two videos right there. This one right here is a magical random video that YouTubers picked just for you. I'd highly recommend it. I'm sure it's going to be very good. This one up here is going to be yesterday's video. I'm looking forward to seeing you tomorrow. I think we'll do a proper celebration of 250,000 subscribers tomorrow. Thank you for being here. I will see you then. Bye bye.